He ran three major Hollywood studios, his movies among the most acclaimed of all time. Go, Willie, go! But after 25 years of titan success in Hollywood, Michael Nathanson says he got burned out, woke up one day and said, enough. It was time to get sober, find deeper meaning, and turn his life around. Today, he still makes films, but answers to a much deeper calling. Away from the hustle of Hollywood to the quiet of the Dakotas, Nathanson found himself deeply moved by the beauty of horses running free in the wild, and deeply in awe of the ranchers and Native Americans he calls heroes, trying to save them in the lands they graze. Nathanson said he had no idea of the threat to wild horses and how key they are to the future of conservation in America. For Nathanson, it was a jolt to the soul that would trigger a transformation he never saw coming. What I saw on these farms and these ranches was beautiful. There's a scene where there's a Native American Indian who does a horse call dance. And these horses come out of the mountains. I mean, it looked like a Hollywood cue. There was no walkie-talkie. There was nobody in the woods. All of a sudden, these horses come out. It was gorgeous. It couldn't be more different than kind of the environment here in Hollywood. It put things in perspective quickly. I just thought there were more important things than what I had been previously believing in. And I realized what the passion these people had about what they were doing and how important our planet is that's disintegrating in front of us.